So you hear politicians as well as teachers, ordinary folks say, we ought to be colorblind. We ought not to see or care about race anymore. But for me, rather than being a virtue, I see colorblindness as often a form of cruelty. Um, to say that you don't care about another person's race is often to say you don't care about their racialized experience. Well, I think colorblindness is a concept uh, or, or a word uh, that we use more as a, as, a, as, a, as a deflection mechanism to avoid dealing with the problem. But the idea that this is a colorblind society is not exactly well accepted in communities of color. And when people insist that we are colorblind, and what, what you're saying is, is that their reality is not real. When it comes to race, what we seem to have decided, it is better if we don't notice when they are people of color or white, or if we notice that we don't talk about it. So even more than color blindness, it's color muteness. Something Julian Bond has told us for years, that to be blind to color is to be blind to the consequences of color. And as he puts it, especially the consequences of being the wrong color in the United States.